Hey there, Pokefam. It's Cypher Noir. It is Tuesday, and I have so many Pokemon cards. So, um, I have, I have a lot. I have a, a lot. I've opened a couple of them to make sure that they weren't artist things. Um, but, uh, so today is going to be a long, long, long video. I am so sorry. Um, because my friend is helping me now, uh, thank you Duo, is now helping me with Team Rocket Returns, so he got me a few of those cards, so those might be in uh, this package. Um, I've got some gym, uh, gym Heroes, I've got some Gym Challenge, and um, I also really, oh, man, I, I, I didn't get these in the mail, but I uh, traded a guy who came to um, a cosplay group that I'm a part of and was like, hey guys, I'm trying to do this thing for my girlfriend. Um, so if you guys have any of these cards, uh, let me know, because he's putting together all the base set cards, well not base set, but like all the first generation uh, Pokemon. And so I tried to help him. Unfortunately, my cards weren't the quality he needed, but I still uh, sent him some cash to make up for it. And I got this really cool reverse foil expedition base set Raichu. And I got a legendary uh, set, uh, Dark Persian, number six out of 110. He also had a ton of, uh, a ton of, I have these all like organized of uh, legendary, and he had a couple of Ruby and Sapphire, and he had uh, some Gym Challenge that I didn't have, and some uh, Neo Genesis and Neo Discovery. So I just want to give a shout out to him. Thank you so much, Tyler, for that. Um, I did accidentally grab a couple duplicates for myself because um, I didn't have my list with me when we traded. But again, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for that. I just really enjoy being part of <laughs> uh, a, a community that's helpful to each other and helps each other out with their sets. And again, thank you so much. Um, so I guess we'll get started with this mountain of stuff. Um, so our first one is from The Cool Place. Again, most of these are probably like one or two cards. Um, I think I have like one that has like 10 cards. Um, okay, so this one has three and I brought my scissors with me because that's, because I need that. Because everybody's taping stuff. So this is from the cool place. Um, and we've got ourselves a couple of cards. We've got Misty's Goldine from the Gym Hero set. And we've got Sabrina's Gengar Hollow Foil. I'm so excited. Ugh. I'm just so excited because I think I finished out this set. But I'm just like waiting on all the cards to come in. We've got... This is, where the heck is it? Um, R&D True Cards. Um, I ordered Brock's Zubat from the Gym Hero set. Uh, why this card was $6, I have no freaking clue, but you know, it's still in pretty good shape. There's a little bit of damage on the back, but that's okay, because it's sitting in the binder anyway. Um, Trying not to give out real people names because that's not cool. We've got a few cards from the local card dealership, all one word. Um, and as with the previous videos, uh, these are from TCG Player. That's honestly just the, it's the best place that I have found um, for my cards. So we've got. Giovanni's Last Resort for Gym Challenge, and we've got Brock's Rhyhorn from Gym Heroes, and then we've got, why did you put it in such a tiny card holder? We've got Blaine's Nine Tails from Gym Challenge, such a beautiful card. And it's gonna get real heavy real fast. Alright. Um, this is from UBOGaming.com. Just some 
one card for this one. This is Koga from Gym Challenge. So one of my favorite things about this is that Gym Heroes was supposed to be um, like Brock, Misty, uh, I think Blaine's in there, um, and uh, Erica, but then they also put Koga, and I feel like the only thing that they could have improved on that was if it was strictly like, okay, so Gym Heroes is the first four um, gyms, leaders, and their Pokemon, and then the um, gym challenge was the last four leaders. I feel like that would have been really cool. Would have been really cool. This is Swampert Sales. And it makes me so mad that I don't have energy cards, so I have to go out and specifically buy energy cards. Like, what the hell? Um, I don't really appreciate that this wasn't in a top loader, but all right. Um, it's just in paper. But uh, Gym Challenge, Grass Energy, again, I think it's really dumb that I'm missing energy cards, but such is life, I guess. Um, <laughs> We've got Card Addicts. And we've got three cards from this seller. I think I'll be able to get out of the envelope. Bruh. They taped it into the envelope. What the hell's wrong with you? Um. <laughs> Okay, so we've got uh, from all three from Gen Gem Challenge. We have Lieutenant Surge's Secret Plan. Y'all, stop with the tape. Um, one of these times I'm actually gonna just accidentally destroy one of my cards. So we've got Lieutenant Surge's Secret Plan from Gem Challenge. We've got Master Ball, which is like pretty decent. Says it was heavily played, but it doesn't really look that way. And then finally we've got Max Revive. I'm just excited that I have been, made some progress with some of these sets. We've got Yeti Gaming, which is local to St. Louis. I really need to like go into the actual store. Oh, okay. So this is one of the cards that Duo got me from Team Rocket Returns. It is a Surprise Time Machine. I should say that better. Surprise Time Machine! <laughs> so we've got this bad boy. Next up we've got Nord Bay. Here, I'll see if they uh, put in a slip. North Bay TCG LLC. No, they didn't. So, uh, I hope I pronounced that right. And we've got a really thick top loader for one card, but okay. Whatever floats your goat. We have Misty's Dugong from the Gym Challenge set. Next up, we got Moose Loop. Of course, they put more magic cards uh, <laughs> to back my uh, to back my cards. So we've got Blaine from the Gym Challenge set, and we've got a whole bunch of magic cards that I could probably just resell. But uh, thank you. <laughs> this is how I get back here. This is how I get it. Well, back into. Um, or, uh, magic. So we've got Divine CCG for this next one. We've got one card from them. We've got a damaged Geo Giovanni from Gym Challenge set. It doesn't even look damaged, so like, go me, I guess. I'm all asleep. We got Giovanni. Got uh, game goblins. I'm gonna cut this one open because they have it in a weird plastic mailer. I thought I almost didn't cut it open. Alright. 
We've got... Ooh. Tape, that's what we've got. We've got all of the tape, all of the tape, all of the time. I just honestly need to get all of my nails done to where one of them is like really, really sharp. Like I could cut fabric with it. Honestly, that that's what I need. That's what I need to tell my nail tech. Lucy, give me claws. I need claws. Okay, so we got two dark sand slashes from the Team Rocket return set. Um, really cute. I don't know why I got two, but all right. Um, so we've got okay. um, we've got Lieutenant Surge's Electabuzz. I'm sure my heckin' postal people are just tired of me getting all of these heckin' letters and stuff. So we've got Lieutenant Surge's Electabuzz from the Gym Hero set, and we don't have anybody behind him. We've got Underworld, U-N-D-R-W-R-L-D-L-L-C. Um, they're from North Carolina. Ooh, excuse me. So we've got Erica's Jigglypuff from the seller from the gym challenge set. for me to organize all my cards. Come on. These top loaders will be the death of me. Y'all. We got Erica's Jigglypuff. Putting it on pile. This one is from Wild Things Games. I'm gonna have to cut it open. Give me a heart attack one of these days. All right, so we got transparent walls from um, Battlegrounds to board games from the Gym Challenge set. Cracker Jack Collection. Oh, and they've got, I think we've gotten ordered something from them before because we've got their totally adorable card, Cracker Jack Collections. It's a Crystal Oshawott. Very dapper, very adorable. We've got uh, Sabrina's Ghastly from the uh, Gym Challenge set, not Gym Heroes, Gym Challenge. Came in really cute. Ooh. We've got the Side Deck Gaming Cafe. That sounds fun, and they're in South Carolina. I might have to go there sometime. So we've got Sabrina's Mr. Mime from Gym Challenge, and it's trapped in here. Okay, here we go. Because <laughs> it's like, okay, so it's like this, and it looked like it was taped on all four sides. I'm like, oh no, it's trapped in here forever. Um, Sabrina's Mr. Mime from Gym Challenge, like I said. Uh, Desert Sky Games from Arizona, Chandler, Chandler. <laughs> they sent it with a stamp for George H. W. Bush. No, just give me the card, please. <laughs> yeah. Why do you think it's a good idea to take this into the envelope? We've got the Gym Challenge, uh, Lightning Energy, and I believe that's all from this. Yeah, this is all from this set. Or not this set, but this seller. Um, Really good quality. It says that it's moderately played, but it honestly looks like it's a near mint, but you know, <laughs> to each their own. 
next one is darkest darkest Wark TCG. I really hope that they put their uh, I hope that they put their um, thing on it on the slip because then I can actually read it correctly. And they tape it closed like heathens, y'all. Oh my goodness. So they had it like this and they taped it up here and then I ripped it. And then there's more tape, guys. Why is there so much tape? Azula, why is there so much tape? Okay, this is Lieutenant Surge's Radicate from uh, the Gym Challenge set and it's by Darkest Lariat TCG. Okay, all one word. Um, This one says it was lightly played. And it does look like it's in really good condition, so we're pretty happy about that. Oh well my good guys are. We've got Oasis games. We've got two cards from them. Both from Gym Challenge. We've got Koga's Bat. Number 83, um, and we've got the Cinnabar City Gym. This is what one of you playing with that. Hey, excuse me. So we've got Koga Zubat, and we've got Cinnabar City Gym. Actually, a pretty decent card. Ignore weakness when a water Pokemon does damage to a Pokemon with Blaine in its name. So that's nice. That's a pretty decent card. Alright. This is from River Kills Hobbies. All oh, the little envelope. A little cardboard envelope. So I feel a little better about this. It may not be in a, um, a um, top loader, but that's okay. We've got Koga's Pidgey from the Gym Challenge set. Again, moving more stuff. I promise I will cycle all of this. I'm not a disgusting heathen when it comes to that. Uh, so we've got Game Swap. Oh, it's killing me. Oh, it's tape. I didn't even get the other half of it. <laughs> Another little cardboard envelope. We've got... Oh, wrong by. We've got a Rockets Hitmonchan from the Gym Heroes set. Finally, we got another Gym Heroes. This one was really cute. It's from, um, oh, they didn't put a little uh, thing in it. So it's MWSA. It's uh, Recall for Gym Heroes, uh, moderately played. Um, and they also have a YouTube channel. So if you wanna follow that, it's Mystic Warriors. Um, I sent this bad boy in a thick one of the wider um, top loaders. So we got Recall from Gym Heroes. Internet Sales Team. That doesn't sound right, but okay. So let's get this list out. For the packing slip, rather. And y'all, oh, I'm just gonna hulk them out. I'm just gonna hulk out all of them. There you go stuck in my chair. So we've got a couple of gym... Okay, so we've got five cards from them. Oh, we got some Neo Genesis and Neo Revelation as well. Um, I think I wanted to hit the $5 minimum and that's why. Uh, so we've got... This is actually the Dragon's Den games. Dragon's Den is one word. 
So we've got Lieutenant Surge from the Gym Hero set. We've got Balloonberry from Neo Revelations. We've got Wooper from Neo Genesis. Professor Elm from Neo Genesis. And the Miracle Berry. Oh man, and we're like only halfway through the pile. Good lord. Cardcade is next. This is just one. This is a hollow rare. This is Erica's Vile Plume from Gym Heroes. Hollow foil. Look at how beautiful she is. Actually, Vile Plume is one of my favorite grass type Pokemon. Just in case you didn't know that. Uh, so we've got Philly. I don't know if it's pronounced Pawn or Fawn. Uh, Philly Fawn TCG. So we've got, you guys wanna check it out. Um, Cause I don't wanna mispronounce it. Um, Cause I have some friends that their last names are pronounced Fawn and then other friends that are pronounced Pawns. So I don't know. Okay, so we've got Misty from Gym Heroes. It's the non hollow version. Clear the pile! Oh goodness, I have a trash can. Uh, so this is Bear Paws Bodega. That's really cute. I actually really like that. We've got Sabrina's Haunter from Gym Heroes. Man, they put it in two penny sleeves? Whoa. Y'all, this is the big leagues. Um. <laughs> Sabrina Conjure from Gym Heroes. This one is not, does not have a return address, so we'll figure that out. Oh, actually we do, it's Electrodon. them and it's the rare version of Lieutenant Surge's Raichu. Put this tape off of here. Me. Oh, yeah. Got Lieutenant Surge's Raichu. Such a beautiful card. I love me a Raichu. I love me a fat chonky bully. So sorry if you see my head. Um, so we've got Deep Cold Gaming. We've got Brock from here, uh, Gym Heroes, the hollow foil version. Um, whoop. Really happy about that. Whoop! And then I dropped it. Thank God I have carpet. Boop. And no children. Uh, this is Finnish, like, uh, the people, F-I-N-N-I-S-H, Finnish last TCG, from Florida. So much tape, I'm gonna scream, 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 scream. Oh my goodness. This is Lieutenant Surge's Electabuzz from Gym Heroes, the hollow foil. It says it's damaged. Oh, I see a little crease. Okay. I was like, how is it damaged? Hmm. Lieutenant Surge's Electabuzz. Did you, okay, I hope that you put the packing slip in here because I can't, I don't want to give anybody a real name, my guy. So we've got, uh, 
um, from, again, the local card dealership. I guess I ordered from them twice. Um, it is Porygon from... Oh, it's Porygon from Team Rocket. Okay, the Team Rocket set, because that's the last card I needed. Because I didn't realize that I didn't order it, and now this thing doesn't want to open. Okay. There we go. Azula, ma'am, you don't need to be messing with that. It's sealed. Oh, I was like, what? Like, it's going in a binder, doesn't need to be double sealed. We got Porygon from the Rocket set, which means that the Team Rocket set is finished. I'm so glad. This is a different order from the local card dealership, and it's um, <laughs> Jim Hero's cards. I think I just accidentally order from him all the time, and um, don't, <laughs> obviously, I mean to, but I don't mean to. So we've got Lieutenant Surge's Magneton from Jim Heroes. We've got Misty. That's the Holofoil version. We've got Holofoil Lieutenant Surge. Misty Sea King. And we've got the Holofoil uh, Rocket Scyther. Doesn't look like there's any other cars in there. This is from. Oh, it's mine. Oh man, that is damage. Oof. This is from uh, Mockingjay, M C K N G J A Y. This is Rockets Moltres from Gym Heroes, and it is damaged, and they sealed up almost the entire freaking top of the top loader. Don't do that! Try not to be frustrated with y'all, but I can't open it and they, they sit in a binder. Like, they don't need... It's already crinkled. There we go. There we go. Good lord. Alright, so this poor thing has seen some things. Rocket Small Trace, number 12 out of 132 from Gym Heroes. It looks like somebody sat on it, maybe. <laughs> Uh, Evolution Jimmy Ink. This next. Whoop. We've got Misty Seedra. Oh, and I love the card that, or the, the penny sleeve they put with it. I love rainbows. I'm a sucker for rainbows, y'all. We've got Misty Seedra from Gym Heroes. Hollow Foil. Moving the pile. Okay. We've got OMG CCG exclamation point LLC. Alright, we've got from Gym Heroes Lieutenant Surges Firo. Such a beautiful card, flying off into the sunset like I wish I could do. Bayside Thrift. Oh. We've got Erica's Victory Bell from Gym Heroes. Hell yeah, AC! It's gonna be a butt head. There we go. There we go. We've got Erica's, Erica's Victory Bell. Oof, this one's heavy. This is from. Yeah, 
I ordered 20 cards and are those not even... Okay. This is... Oh, here we go. Okay. I was like, what? This is Poke Fam Nation. There's 20 cards in this, so I feel like that's pretty good. We've got a bunch of gym challenge cards, and then we've got a couple of gym hero cards. Um, because I was missing, uh, Koga's, I think it was, oh, Brock's Mankey and Brock's Zubat from Gym Heroes. So we've got, oh, of course I dropped it, Blaine's Ponyta, Brock's Geodude, Erica's Paris, Fighting Energy, that's Neo Genesis. I don't remember ordering that. I did not order that. That's weird. Yeah, I will have to reach out to them because that's not the energy I ordered. Um, Fuchsia City Gym, Giovanni's Nidoran Mail. We've got Grass Energy. We've got Koga's Akans. Koga's coughing. That's all for this pile. <sighs> no matter how much room I am given, I will not ever have enough. We've got Koga's Weedle. Koga's we Weezing. Whoop. Misty's Polywag, number 90 or 89. We've got Misty's Star You. Psychic Energy. Eric, or Sabrina's Drowsy, can't read apparently, Sabrina's Ghastly, Saffron City Gym, Brock's Mankey, and Brock's Zubat from the Gym Hero set. Anyway, man, but like, oof. This is Matt's Cavalcade for this next seller. Misty's Tentacle from Tim Heroes. Yeah, I don't know why this was such an expensive card, but it is. So, oh, and we got Erica from Jim's Heroes. Um, so we've got the Holofoil Erica, and we've got Misty's Tentacle. The Wasteland Gaming. This is from Gym Heroes and is no removal gem. Oh, cards I found. I'm dumb. <laughs> cards I found. Uh, cards I found. Okay, we've got Erica's for Fable, which is a hollow foil from the Gym Heroes set. They say it's damaged. I don't know how it's damaged. There's a little bit of white around the back of the edges, but okay. From Conway Games. This is Erica's Weepin' Bell from the Gym Hero set. And he looks so cute. And this is the face I make whenever I see really attractive people. Wait a second. So many layers. This is the face I make whenever I see really attractive people. Oh no, I'm in love. <laughs> We've got Wind Condition Games. Me. So much tape. It's tough. It's like a present. I don't know what's in it. Um, because I'm dumb and I order a bunch of stuff at once. Alright. Um, 
so we've got another Misty's Polywag, but this is a different one than the other one, I promise. This is Misty's Polywag number 87. Yeah, 87. And then we have Misty's Tentacool Hollow Foil from the Gym Hero set. We've got the Great Half, spelled H A A F. Let me take it up everything. Good lord. Alright, so this is the Rockets Training Jam Stadium card from Jim Heroes. even have a really cool card and apparently they do um, um, um twitch so that's cool follow them i suppose rockets training gym 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 <laughs> oh man we're almost done with the huge pile and we just have a little bit uh, okay I just gotta hold all of these. This is Dragon's Den Games. We've got Brock's Training Method from Gym Heroes. Uh, they gave me a Steel Energy. Oh, they gave me Steel Energies to uh, cover the back, I guess. Um, we've got TCG Dad. Y'all will be the death of me, I swear to God. Uh, yeah. This is Minion of Team Rocket from the Gym Heroes set. So this one is in a plastic mailer, plastic mailer in a plastic bag in cardboard in paper, it's the packing slip. This is from Con DT Conway. Good lord. This is my Blaine's Moltres from Gym Heroes. This was the most expensive card from this set. Which isn't terrible, like honestly it's not bad to be spending only 30, like $35 on one game, or $33 on one card, but still oofy. So we've got Blaine's Moltres. <sighs> we've got Salad Fingers, that is literally their seller name. Salad Fingers. This is Erica's Execute number 43 out of uh, Gym Heroes. It also looks like that it's been sat on, but it is a first edition, so that's cool. <laughs> no packing slip on this one, um, so I, and I don't feel comfortable saying somebody's uh, real name. Um, this is a Team Rocket Returns, but it's also one of the um, the, the sets or de decks that, um, the championship deck, uh, if that makes sense. If you guys don't know, um, whenever they do the Pokemon tournaments, they do uh, the winner's deck in, uh, they recreate it and they produce it. And so we've got POW hand extension from Team Rocket Returns from the World Champions Championships 06. I think it'd be cool if I could go and do that, but I don't even play normally. <laughs> we've got multi monster deals. This is. Brock's Graveler from uh, Gym Challenge. Come on, you got this. I don't got this, guys. There we go. 
Yeah, I don't got this, guys. <laughs> there we go. Isn't she beautiful? We've got cards from Cho. We've got two Team Rocket Returns cards. We've got Rocket's Pokeball. And we've got Dark Dragonair, and she is adorable. So we've got Dark Dragonair, and we've got Rocket's Pokeball. <laughs> We've got Limitless Games from Chaos. It's Bling Rapidash from uh, Gym Challenge. And of course, they take the entire top again. Y'all, stop. It just needs a little piece of tape over part of it. Oh, good lord. go. Whoop. Flames Rapidash. Whew. We've got six more. Seven more? Six more. I can count. I promise. We've got Sabrina's Jinx. Oh, and we've got another one of the uh, rainbow. Oh, this is the Nexus cards in games. got one of the rainbow uh, card sleeves. I just, I love me some rainbow, y'all. We've got Sabrina's Jinx from Gym Challenge. Alter Reality Games. Oh, okay. Sabrina's Kadabra from Gym Challenge. And another little uh, cardboard envelope. Gonna... Sabrina's Cadabra from Gym Challenge. Next up, we got the Wasteland Gaming. It's Giovanni's Meow from Gym Challenge. Um, number 5843. Can't count. I can't read. Giovanni's Meow. Family Fun Hobbies. We've got Misty Psyduck from Gym Challenge. And he looks just as confused as I do about the state of our world. Ow. I shocked myself. Misty Psyduck. This one also doesn't have a, okay, doesn't have a card, but, uh, so we've got Blaine's Quiz number three. I also do have Blaine's Quiz number two coming in eventually, and then we have Blaine's Charmander from Gym Heroes, and then finally we have Fanboy Collectibles and Comics. It was a lot of cards, and if you've made it this far, I appreciate you. Uh, finally, we have Sabrina's Haunter from the Gym Challenge set. If it will stop being attached to everything, that would be fantastic. So finally, we got this bad boy. Let me know what your favorite card is from this uh, poll. I would love to hear your opinion. Honestly, I'm torn between uh, Blaine's Moltres and Dark Dragoneer. Um, 
but uh, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, hit that bell that goes ding when I post stuff. I open up Pokemon cards on Tuesdays, I talk about Pokemon merchandise on Thursdays, I talk about Pokemon art and artists um, sporadically, and I also uh, do updates on my Pokemon room. Um, at this point, we're almost done. We're still putting up some of the sound squares so that it doesn't echo as much. Um, and we're also, uh, I'm working on the mural. So, uh, check it out. Um, <laughs> I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye. Stay cool, Poke fam.